Hello, what's up guys? Today we have got uh, a Earson Bluetooth speaker, which is model number is ER-152. It comes in in uh, three different colors, which is a, one is a blue, pink, and also white and gray color, black, black sort of shed, steel gray sort of color, which is just the one which you can see here. And it is an in in NFC enabled device, NFC enabled device, that means so that means that if you've got a mobile phone which is NFC enabled, so you do not need to enter any pin number, pin pin to peer it up. It's just a straightforward peering wise. So which is pretty good. As you can see now, a speaker is a pretty pretty round in shape with the two speakers in the front, which are 1.5 each, so which makes him three watt speaker. And active radio, sorry, passive radiator in the in the left one of the corners. Or I would say, if I look at the left hand side, passive radiator, uh, passive radiator, which creates a very nice sort of base here. And as you do, and from this side, you got a three buttons. One is for Bluetooth peering, for Bluetooth peering, and the two button right there is a plus and negative plus and my. They are multi functions, multi function buttons. So if you hold it, hold the plus button, it will increase the volume. And if you hold the negative button, it will decrease the volume, obviously. But they can work also in, in terms of navigation as well. So you can, by pushing, pushing your leg go, it works as a navigator too. And uh, it works as a hand-free as well. So if you're going to, if you want to make a call, attend a call, you just need to press this Bluetooth button. So that is a hand-free too. Right here, you will see a red light, which is for the red, red two holes here. They, one of them is, they are basically LEDs to notify you. So obviously the blue is for the Bluetooth and red is for the charging purpose. And when they flash both together, that means it's, it's wanted to peer up or something. So, and right here, which is a cover up area. And uh, right there, you see uh, on and off button and micro USB for the charging purpose. An auxiliary port for uh, old school MP3 players. All right, and uh, quality wise, Earson is a pretty good one. Pretty good. Uh, they, they they do really nice speakers for sure. Uh, as I as you can see from my other uh, reviews, I had reviewed one of their model, which was a uh, Earson ER-151, which was a really really nice looking as well, triangle shape. But that one is a shock proof, dust proof, splash proof. But this is just a standard. So let's uh, let's play it. Let's start it. Let's be start to pair with the mobile phone and let's see the quality. So I'm gonna play it on. Turn it on. Once you turn it on, you hear the notification. Okay, and you see this light is flashing. That means it's wanted to pair up. So you put it there. It's an NFC enabled device. So what we're gonna do. I'm gonna just uh, NFC. Everything is enabled in my mobile phone. So I just need to hook it like that. Yes, I wanna pair it. So let it peer off. Right, again, it's asking for pin number. That is a very strange. Normally, don't happen. But it's asking for it. That means it's not a very good system. I, I would say that peering is not that good. That means. Here you go. We are peered up now. I'm gonna play some music right there. It is a very loud, very loud music and bass is very good as well. It's not deteriorating at all. And you can see that when you're playing the bass song, I always try to play the same song because I wanted to show the viewers that by playing the same song, same, same devices around me, what, what is the difference you can find actually. It's very hard to put in video that how the sound quality but uh, you can only look at that old video or you know new videos and all these things to compare it with. So as you can see that now it's paired up and I played us a bit of music on it too. It's in front of you. It's uh, very nice looking as you can see that. And the parts which came along with it, one is this stripe, hand stripe. Second one was a micro USB standard for the charging purpose. Third one is is an auxiliary cable just for the old school uh, old school uh, mp3 players 
in terms of driver it's got these two drivers in the front which are uh, 1.75 inches two drivers which is very nice sound coming out of it and uh, obviously it's an NFC device and the communication wise the built-in it's got communication wise uh, it's the a a2 dp stereo music system in there which is very nice too which is very nice too and uh, battery it's got a 10 sorry 10 uh, i think 1000 milliampere hour battery in there which is a which is 3.7 volt one uh, 3.7 volt and uh, 1000 milliampere hours and it's a combination of rubber and plastic as you can see that and uh, what i should I say it's a lithium battery which is a mini one as well so which is nice too and you can easily get working with the volume with the size of the volume you can get about uh, five to five five to six hours out of it in runtime which is nice too so let me uh let me play some music around first so i'm gonna leave it i'm gonna leave it play some music and i can control these control the volume by using these navigation buttons As I hold it, the volume minus button so decrease the volume. If I want it to increase it, I'm gonna press, press to hold the plus button. If I want to navigate around it, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna navigate the next song. So what I'm gonna do, plus touch and leave it. Song is changing further. You can see that. I increase the volume by holding it again. do have a holders here right there so if you put it like in like uh, like in anywhere it do it it will do on hold on hold on itself on these rubber holders so it looks very decent in that way as well you can see that So if you increase the volume, it do have a notification sound too. So that's a, that's a plus point. So All on average is a pretty decent and very nice Bluetooth speaker. I'm sure people would like to have one of those. And the price wise, it cost me about 23 pounds. So that's not a bad price for the very, very nice looking and very nice looking and very good sound quality Bluetooth speaker. Uh, if you do, if you got any more question about that Bluetooth speaker, please do let me know. Please do let me know. Uh, I will be happy to answer that. If you like my video, please hit the like button. If you want to know more about the speaker, please write in below comments. And please do subscribe because it will help me to improve my quality and obviously help me to make more money on it. Thank you very much for watching this video and hope you will see me within a few days with another Bluetooth speaker. Thank you very much. Cheers, bye.